My female 27 flatmate, female 28, has expressed she has sexual feelings towards me, but I am in a happy relationship with my boyfriend, male 27. My 24 female wife, 26 female, of almost two years has ADHD, and I'm struggling with her memory problems. My SO, 31 female, is well off. She is constantly buying expensive gifts for me, 25 male, even when I ask her not to. For Christmas, she wants to pay off my student loans as her Christmas present. However, we have only been dating for barely a year. My female 27 flatmate, female 28, has expressed she has sexual feelings towards me, but I am in a happy relationship with my boyfriend, male 27. My female 27 flatmate, female 28, moved in with me about six months ago. We've known each other for eight years and are really good friends. We used to live quite far away from each other, so only really saw each other maybe around four times a year. Obviously, now that we live together, we see a lot of each other. We both work from home and do lots of social things together. I've introduced her to a lot of my local friends. We are really close friends and a few times she has ended up sleeping in my bed with me as she says my bed is so comfortable. I am bisexual but I don't see her in a sexual way. I see her like a sister. I've also always thought she is straight so never thought anything of this. However, a few weeks ago, she told me that she has started to feel a sexual attraction to me. I was completely taken aback by this as it came as a massive shock, surprise. I have been with my boyfriend, male 27, for three years and we have a great and happy relationship. She knows this and knows him quite as well as he is around lots and we will hang out together. When she first told me because I was so shocked and not sober, I didn't really say much back. I think I just said, okay. We spoke about it when sober and she said, obviously nothing can happen because you're in a relationship, and I agreed. I haven't told her explicitly that I don't fancy her as she seemed really upset and I was worried about hurting her feelings, but she's clear that nothing can or will happen. It was a bit awkward for a few days, but it has got less awkward with the time. The other day though, she did get into my bed after we had been drinking together and kept stroking my hair and trying to coddle me. I told her to stop and she eventually got out of my bed and went to hers. She apologized the next morning. I have told my boyfriend about all of this. He doesn't seem annoyed, just a bit surprised. He suggested I ask here for advice. I feel guilty because I feel as though I've shared something very personal, a secret about my flatmate. She's clearly going through a lot right now. She's always thought she was straight, so these feelings are probably a little confusing for her. I am also finding it hard because I'm worried that parts of my friendship with my flatmates, such as complimenting each other and being affectionate towards each other, may no longer be appropriate. We are often joking with each other, and now I'm worried that it can be interpreted as flirting. I basically don't know what to do or how to handle this situation. I'm really worried I'm going to end up hurting someone I care about. I also don't know how strong my flatmate's feelings are towards me, whether it's just a physical thing or if it's something deeper. It feels wrong to seek advice from friends because I have to share something very personal about my flatmate with them, who they all know. Has anyone been in a similar situation before? Does anyone have any advice about how I should handle this situation? How can I reduce the awkwardness and set clear boundaries without hurting my flatmate and our friendship? My 24 female wife, 26 female, of almost two years has ADHD, and I'm struggling with her memory problems. I feel like the world's biggest a-hole, but I'm struggling with dealing with my wife's ADHD symptoms, namely, her memory. She forgets things really easily, especially things she needs to do or deadlines. For example, I'll ask if she could empty the dishwasher after I've cooked so I could clean up, and she'll say yeah, and then we're getting ready for bed and I'll ask and she forgot. This means I have to constantly remind her to do things I've asked her to do, and try to watch what she's doing to catch her right before she starts doing something new to remind her to do the things she needs to do. This means I manage all the chores. Make sure all the bills get paid, plan the meals, 
do the shopping, and if I want any help with it, I have to ask over and over again and hope it sticks it long enough for her to do it. She goes to work, comes home, and plays video games until bedtime. I feel so wrong for being upset about this because I know we both have depression. She can't help that she forgets so easily and she can't help that most days, all she wants to do is play games. But I feel so alone in managing the entire household. And sometimes, I feel like I'm babysitting her to make sure she does basic tasks like change the sheets once in a while. I wanted a partner, but sometimes, it feels like I have a child. I try not to let her know how much this bothers me because it's not her fault. But the frustration can just bubble over. Does anyone have any advice for how I can address my feelings to stop being upset about this? My SO, 31 female, is well off. She is constantly buying expensive gifts for me, 25 male, even when I ask her not to. For Christmas, she wants to pay off my student loans as her Christmas present. However, we have only been dating for barely a year. We have similar hobbies and both work in tech. She is very much has the dominant personality that makes it very hard for me to refuse her. But she isn't abusive or anything like that. There is also a fairly big age gap, but I really like her. Trish is well off. She was one of the first employees at a tech company that ended up being bought out by a larger one. I don't really know how wealthy she is, but I honestly don't care. While she does oftentimes spends a lot of money, several times she has told me money isn't an issue for her. She has also very much told me that she knows what she is doing regarding money. Monday was my birthday. She spent probably somewhere over a 1k on gifts for me. The thing is that they were all things at one point. I made a comment about it or something. She bought me a watch that I vaguely remember looking at back in February. I said it was a nice watch. So there is a thought there. I tried to get her to return the stuff, saying this is way too much, but she 100% refused. For her birthday back in July, I made her favorite food and seemed genuinely happy with this, and specifically forbade me from spending money on her. On the other hand, I am poor. I got a master's in a useless subject and currently work as entry-level software developer. I have a ton of debt and frankly, my finances were a mess. She knows how much of a mess they were because she sat down with me one day and basically untangled the mess and taught me proper budgeting, investing, etc. Last night, we were talking about Christmas and what our plans are. Eventually, it came to gifts, where I basically begged her not to spend anything on me forever, and that I cannot get her anything on the same level of what she bought me. She made a big deal and told me she didn't want anything like that, and she wanted her gift to be spending Christmas with me. Trish, on the other hand, said that her gift for me is she's going to pay off all my debt, so I can stop worrying about it. I really thought she was joking, but she is completely serious. Personally, I said, sure, because that is pretty awesome. I feel this is insane, and I genuinely don't understand. We have been dating less than a year. Everyone I have talked to has either said she is joking or lying, but I know she isn't. Makes me all the more confused. I am looking for advice. I really just don't know how to respond or handle this type of thing at all. I do genuinely really love spending time with her, and if she never paid a cent, she is still easily the best person I have ever dated. Can someone help me please?